hello friends welcome back this video uh, I'm going to talk on code quality check okay so code quality check from the name itself you can judge wh what I'm going to talk code quality check checking the quality of your code now why it is important okay uh, you must be in, in a question like we, we we are just doing a testing and why our code quality is important though though you are doing uh, though you are coding your automation script okay Ir irrespective which kind of automation tool you use whether you use qtp whether you use uh, selenium or uh, any other okay irrespective of that uh, you must have heard code quality is very important for developers okay they they do uh, many things for uh, code quality check they do peer programming they do peer review uh, they get the review done by their seniors their leads they use another uh, code analysis or autom automation tool for this code quality check okay so all those things are applicable when you are coding for your automation test cases okay uh, your code is very much important quality of your code is very much important okay and uh, in, in coming few sessions I'm, I'm going to talk about that why it is important and how we can do the code analysis by using some automation tools okay so why code quality check okay why it is important okay the very first thing is it makes your code readable okay uh, let, let us say I have coded some uh, or I have designed some automation framework but if the next person if someone some new joiners is not able to understand from the names uh, let, let us say from class names or from methods name or or uh, or uh, like what what I am going to do with some methods uh, with the parameters what I am passing if they are not readable that doesn't make any sense for the new persons right though I am able to understand my code but that that's not the only thing okay everyone everyone should be able to understand your code your code should be readable right that's the that's the very first point uh, it makes easy to maintain the code in feature definitely it, it makes very easy because uh, e even if you are not maintaining the code even if the third third person is maintaining the code uh, since your code is more readable he can he can understand very easily w what this particular method is doing what are the parameters and all right he, he can understand very easily that that makes very easy to maintain your code in the features now code quality check why why would why, why we do code quality check not not because uh, uh, not not because only it makes your code readable and easy to maintain in the feature but the m more than that it is important to find out the bugs if, if there is any bugs which can be found before it goes to uh, actual testing okay so like th there are there are two kind of uh, uh, analysis static code analysis and dynamic code analysis okay so static static means you are you are you are reviewing the code before you execute it right so that, that's what it is static okay and what are uh, what and all you check in static uh, what is the length of the method name what are the, how many number of parameters uh, ma maximum minimum I'm passing what is the name of your classes uh, are they readable uh, how how you named your variables uh, static now like wh wh whatever and what else like like likewise we have many things okay that that makes your code uh, that that may make your code weak or that may makes your code very much better right so to uh, to identify those things which can uh, lick the defects in in feature right so to identify those things that is the foremost important uh, uh, thing uh, which leads to code quality check right so d and and if i if i get the defects very early at an earlier stage that uh, do reduce my time and fixing time and even cost right so that's the main factor right so see doing code review doing code review is one of the part of code quality check right but that's the manual process okay and uh, the automated process to do code quality check is by using some tools like there are many tools in the market uh, like there are various tools for quality check and the tools are sonar cube uh, reshaper 
code SE and and few others right so there are many other uh, tools available to do the code analysis automatically uh, which 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 can be integrated with your continuous integration pipeline okay uh, okay now what are the benefits of using this uh, static code analysis by using this automated tools uh, let us call uh, uh, let us take an example of sonar cube what's the benefit of using this uh, sonar cube over your manual process so so till now uh, not till now before five years we used to do manual review manual code review uh, if i am coding my senior will do code review for me for me my manager may do code review for me even my colleague may do uh, some code review for me right so the aim of both is same okay to 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 make your code readable to detect the bugs and few other okay the aim is same not uh, detecting bug is not the always aim of quality check right so th there are few other factors not 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 that the always so well, what is the benefit of using your static code analysis by using your automation tool the very first thing is speed okay because it, it takes a time for developer to do the manual code reviews but automation tool can do it much faster okay that's the first one then the depth coverage because uh, yeah in ma in manual code review it, it it may take some time for you to do the review uh, you may not check each things line by line right you may skip something right so if if you are using the automation tool like sonar cube for doing your uh, code analysis static code analysis it, it will not miss anything that's the tool right it will not miss anything that's the second thing and what else we have again accuracy yes accuracy definitely it is more uh, for your automation tools uh, such as sonar cube for your java so that's the uh, those are the important factors for the quality check and why we will prefer this quality check right just remember quality check code quality check is not only for developers who develop actual application but it is also important for the automation engineers automation developer who write the automation test scripts right because your test scripts carries the same important as your uh, the actual development code carries right because even that is very much important because uh, as on as on when you update you as on when you are uh, adding a new features or you are doing some changes into your application your actual product code you need to update you need to make changes to your automation script as well right though you are not going to deliver your automation test cases the code of your automation test case to the client but that matters a lot to you right you are going to work on that only right so that's the reason this code quality check is even important for uh, automation testers right so uh, what what we are going to do here is we are going to use sonar cube for static code analysis and we are going to integrate that sonar cube uh, which is my static analysis code into the continuous integration pipeline right so what i am going to do is i am going to call it from jenkins okay and how we are going to do is we'll be talking it on next session okay thank you for watching